palabra ahora al Ashe Sumatra National Liberation Front. Por favor. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. My name is Asnavi Ali. On behalf of the Ashe Sumatra National Liberation Front, or EASNL, I wish to draw the attention of the forum on the situation in my homeland, Ashe, in Sumatra. For almost 30 years, between 1976 until 2005, Aceh was under massive initial military operations against pro-independence movement that caused tens of thousand casualties and uncountable serious human rights violations. It's well documented that most of the violations have been committed by Indonesian armed forces in the form of summary extrusion, torture, and forced disappearances, arbitrary arrest, etc. On 26 December 2004, Aceh was heavily damaged by Indian Ocean tsunami, which claimed over 170,000 lives. Mr. Chairman, 12 years after the natural disaster and 11 years after the ending of armed conflict, much of its infrastructure might have been rebuilt, but the people of Aceh is still desperately struggling for its fundamental changes in civil, political, economic, social, and cultural rights. Many human rights organizations have also recommended prosecution of those responsible, restoration of civilian institutions, ending the culture of impunity with the military, and reallocation and of resources between the central and provincial government. Mr. Chair, in finding a durable solution to the complexity of the problem, Indonesia should review its old policy towards Aceh, particularly with regards to fundamental freedoms, such as freedom of expression and the right to self-determination of the people of Aceh. The ASNF call you for international communities, especially the EU and the UN, to closely monitor the situation in Aceh and put pressure on Indonesia to end impunity by resolving to the past human rights abuses during 30-year armed conflicts. Therefore, AASNL endorses the forum recommendation of Article 26G and 32D concerning organization or individual responsible for human rights violation. Thank you for your attention. Muchas gracias. Voy a dar la palabra ahora a la